Harry, another horrific night for Manchester United. 4-3 defeat in the Champions League at Copenhagen. Do you think Copenhagen have just finished off Eric Ten Hag? Look, you know, um, never mind Copenhagen. Um, it's more difficult coping with Eric Ten's place's crap tactics at the moment. Um, you know, we were all over the place, weren't we? But, you know, I really felt as though the game changed when uh, we went down to 10 men, uh, when, you know, R R Mason Mount came on. Uh, but look, I can promise our, our the Man United fans that we won't go any lower than fourth in the group. That's a guarantee. The winning goal was a beauty, and we've got to say it, Rooney, he is a massive talent, isn't he, Harry? Oh, Rooney was absolutely amazing. Uh, what a player Rooney is, and um, he, he's lost so much weight, and he looks he looks about 40 years younger uh, from you know when he used to play for Man United. And I think you know to manage Birmingham City. Yeah, and to play up front for Copenhagen in the Champions League in, in the same week just shows what a great professional he is. I've got a lot of respect for Wayne Rooney, fair play to him. As usual, some very controversial VAR decisions. Was yours a handball, Harry? Yeah, no, it wasn't a handball. So, um, you know, it didn't actually touch any part of my arm. It touched my elbow. So I don't understand why the penalty was given. Uh, the only issue I've got now is that Eric, 10 minutes away from getting the sack, you know, has told me that he wants me to play in goal against Luton Town, so, because he said that, you know, I'm much better with my arms than, oh no, nah, uh, and he's got a great point there, to be fair, so. Harry, your deluded manager, Eric Ten Hag, actually believes you are closing the gap on City. Do you agree? Yeah, you know, I think that, you know, Eric, 10 minutes away from getting his P45, has got a great point. You know, I really, I really do. I think we are closing the gap on City uh, to only concede four goals against a, a world-class team like Copenhagen shows how far we've come. We're definitely closing the gap on, on Chester City. There's no doubt about that. So, And if Eric Ten Hag is sacked, who do you think will replace him as Man United manager? Yeah, look, you know, so when I came into trading this morning, uh, there was uh, 15 trucks of gravy granules being uh, delivered to the training ground. So, um, I'm going to run the bookies later and throw a absolutely loads of dough on, on Big Sam to get the job. It looks like it's going to happen. And, you know, I know people will laugh at that, but this is Manchester United and, you know, anything can happen at this circus. So.